Hello everybody, Imminent Storm here, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. In our last episode, we continued our expansion, and we also had a bit of an issue start to pop up here. The Cult of Titan Heresy has begun spreading into our realm, and so we're trying to take steps to prevent its spread. So I have my auger here uh, proselytizing in an attempt to... Um, can reconvert the province. Now, what I also want to do is I need my marshal. Oh, my steward isn't doing anything. Uh, let's have him research some technology there. What I want to do is I want to call my uh, marshal here and I'm going to tell him to suppress revolts here to try to prevent that uh, you know, rebels from rising up there, so that's one thing we want to do. Now, let me just go ahead and get things kind of ticking here slowly. Um, kind of let things start to move because we need to rebuild our military. Um, you know, we want our military to build up. Oh, and we have this plot running to murder somebody. Uh, this guy that we're trying to kill. Uh, who is it? This dude here. This iconoclast. Alright. He likes to take in the morning air at on his balcony. The fall would be long one indeed if someone was to take a tumble from there. Perhaps the railing could be adjusted slightly. I know someone who can get this done. Okay, so. Uh, let's see, what else do we need to take care of? Uh, special minor titles we need to hand out. Uh, let's see if we can use this to improve someone's opinion. Like this guy. And we need to hand out a commander to m one of my best marshals, which... That guy looks good. Alright, now the other thing that I needed to do that I, that I didn't do yet is I need to create the duchy of Thrace. Because uh, I haven't done that yet, so there we go. Alright, so Province of Thrace is now created. Which is important because that gives us additional vassal limit. Because I wanna I'm not making any dukes because I can't make any dukes yet because I'm not a king. So you know, we're going to be limited in the number of counties we can hold without that in place. Okay, so... Ah, success! Alright, this guy fell to the ground like a piece of rotten fruit when the balcony railing gave way. A tragic accident, as far as anyone is concerned. Gravity can be a cruel mistress. Okay, so... Now... Relations... Now his heir is iconoclast, and his heir is iconoclast. Uh, these stinking iconoclasts. Oh, and they're in the they're in this baronet here. This guy. Oh, we'll have to see if we can deal with it. Alright, the other thing I wanted to do, uh, let me just unpause that again, um, is I actually have the, I think it's a customization DLC installed. So what I actually want to do is, since I'm playing like the Hellenistic Empire, I am getting rid of the name Constantinople and I'm restoring, and I'm restoring... What is going on here? Why can't I type? Well, let me see if I can rename the city. To buy Xantium. It's Greek name there. is going on why 
Byzantium. Okay. There we go. Byzantium. Because Constantinople is the name the Romans gave it. Alright, what's this? Another righteous imprisonment. Now, one thing you might notice is that my audio tends to cut sometimes. That's when my auto auto saves start happening. It, it interrupts my uh, my audio. One hundred percent chance he's a leader of a plot. What plot is he the leader of? He is trying to seduce my wife. Is this that idiot who tried to j get me to join this plot? Yes, it is. I am going to imprison this guy because he's just an idiot. There we go. Alright, let's see. Alright, so we need to assign a commander. Unfortunately, he was one of the better marshals in my realm, so... That's unfortunate. Okay. So, what we need to do is we need to continue our expansion. So we want to become king. Now, also, the other thing we need to worry about is this guy is starting to get up there in age a little bit. Oh, my son already has a whole bunch of kids. Oh, he's a twin. Oh, he's complaining about his dark cell. Do you know what? I am going to send him to the Obliette. That's what he gets for trying to seduce my wife. Alright. So, let's see. Yeah, we should have more than enough forces to deal with anybody here. So, let's continue. This guy, he's next. We're going to declare war. We can press this guy's claim. This guy actually also holds Athens and Corfu. Oh, he is actually Chandax. Where is that? Oh, he's actually quite sizable. Let me think about this for a second. 1,800 men. I think I actually probably want to start ripping off some of his land because I don't want him getting too big. Alright, we're going to declare war for that. And let's raise my levy. Right, we're just going to go with my personal levy for now. Oh, one other thing I've... Well, that's all moving. I need to get my personal study rebuilt in my new capital. We'll take care of that. Right, let's get everybody marching. It feels like everyone is trying to trump me. My huntsmen killed more prey than I, my councils found a better solution to the rebellious peasants than mine, and I started to feel that everyone was better than me no matter what. If they are better than me, then I have to accept that. I gained the kind trait. Okay. And that's one of those traits that I gain from an event, and then I do something that causes me to lose it, and then I gain it again, and then I lose it again. Alright, well, let's march down here and crush their army, and siege down their land, and continue to expand my realm. Okay, yep, flank is collapsing. Oh, and a highborn noble across the field. Who is it? Oh, it was the uh, Legatus of Athenai, uh, of Athens. Athenii, actually. Um, and he turned and ran. A coward. Well, my guy is a pretty formidable fighter, so. Personal study got finished building. Oh, I probably can't actually use it because I'm on campaign. Oh, and we captured him. Excellent. 
Excellent, excellent. So, force our demands. Okay, so we need to find somebody that can manage that new province. So actually, let me try using this here. Find character. We want a male. Um, married ruler, no. Not a ruler. My religion, my culture. Adult, yes. Let's see, let's do a good steward. This guy. Sure, let's grant him a landed title of my newly conquered region. There we go. Okay, piece of cake. And I got out of that relatively unscathed. Uh, one other thing I want to do is I want to keep my construction running here. Now, I can't do a lot else here, but I can... I had that mod installed, so... Let's go... let's build a personal training yard. That's going to be very expensive. Okay, so we're going to need to rebuild some money a little bit before we do our next campaign. Oh, I have a child that needs a guardian. Oh, hold on. Educate the child. I need to pick somebody. Uh, let's see. Greek clinic. And he doesn't like me much. That's fine. My son. Antonio has asked me to spend some quality time in Philippopolis. I'm sure... The idea is for me to become better friends with Porfirios. That sounds nice. Yes, we'll go hang out. Great time together. I feel we have really strengthened our family bonds. Yeah, good. What I could do is try to run a war using my vassal levies. Since my vassals in general have a pretty good opinion of me. Except for this guy. I wonder if I can just keep assassinating them until we get to someone who's Hellenic. Whispers have reached my ears that Veronis Samuel of Lecherne is going to embark on a little boat trip, and I have a good authority that he, like many children, has not yet learned to swim. Ooh, if the boat was to found flounder, I should actually think that should be founder. Well, these things happen all the time, don't they? I know just the men for the job. Yeah, let's see... No, actually, do, do I still have... Maximus is slow to learn to talk. Uh... 50% chance of trusting, 25 slothful, greedy, stutter. Ooh. Birch the words... Oh. Yeah, beat my kid until he starts talking. I don't think so. Um, let Maximus take his time. Send him to the nannies instead. Let's encourage by example. Oh, we got trusting. Okay, so now do we still have this truce? No, the truce is gone. Yeah, the truce is gone. Okay, so... Success! Samuel sank like a stone. That's terrible. Went down with the ship. And we lost the kind trade again. Alright. Um, so, we... Right, we still have this, and we still have an Iconoclast there. 
And yet another iconoclast. Oh, jeez. Siblings. Well, let's just... Oh, Dionysus is now of legal age. Became a naive appeaser. That doesn't sound good. Well, let's just keep knocking these uh, iconoclasts off. Oh, now we have the unlanded sun. Well, we could potentially resolve that issue. Uh, let's see. My son, and he has horrendous stats. Oh, God. Okay, well... Yeah, let's do it, let's do it. Uh, let's... Is this guy in the midst of a war already? Yes, he's at war... Crete. Interesting. Well... Let's declare war. We want to conquest it. Let's raise my vassal forces. Now, he might end up catching some of my guys. Oh, heathens attacked me and tried to spread the holy faith. Barely escaped with my life. Ugh. That cult of titan thing is going to be a thorn in my side. Oh, another boating accident. Rage's imprisonment? This guy. He's a leader of a plot. Okay, what's the plot? He wants to seduce my daughter. Actually, let's try to auto stop the plots. Okay. Alright, let's chase down his army. Alright, success. Okay, what? Well, who's next? This guy, he's iconoclast, and his heir is me. Okay, so that is perfect. Let's off him. Understanding of military matters during the battle. Up, oh. the leader is uh, charging me. Prepare to die. All right, we're gonna duel him. Strike. It's over now. He yields. All right, we take him prisoner. Perfect. And the war is over. Those duel events are almost overpowered in a way. Alright, we usurped the title. Okay, we captured him. Yeah, my son has requested permission to use the training ground, of course. Alright, we disband the army. Okay, so... I could give this to my son so that he becomes landed. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Unlanded son, we're gonna go ahead, we'll grant him a landed title. And we'll make it... This new one. There. My prisoner... 
Uh, 25 gold? Yeah, I'll take it. Watching the animal pens outside Byzantium gave me an idea in how to deal with uh, Gregorius. Concentrated manure can be a very explosive substance, and if enough is gathered in a single place and ignited, the blast could prove lethal. I know a farmer who is just what we need. Well, while we're doing this, let's see how close are we to being able to create the Kingdom of Greece. We have 41% of the kingdom. And cultures... We... is this guy... he's still Serbian. This person's Roman. Oh, we inherited the Varanet. Oh, we had success. We blew him up with manure. He went out with a bang. Okay, so now that gave me... Uh, he thinks I'm taking too much of a risk. So now that gave me... See, that gave me this castle. That might actually be worth just keeping. And I have another castle under construction here. So, yeah, that actually makes it be very useful to just keep that in uh, under my control. At least for now. We might have to give it away when we go through succession and we have characters with lower um, stewardship uh, ratings. Because they might ha have as high a demand size as my current guy has. But... At least for now, it's not a bad idea to hold on to it. Okay. I've learned that Legatus Damianos spoke of his support for me at the faction meeting. And greatly improved the meeting of his faction. Okay, so the tradition faction's opinion is improved. So we have the prosperity faction, we have the tradition faction, the court faction. I think they're all pretty... pretty positive opinion, so that's fine. How's my personal... Good. Yeah, see, look at that. My personal levy is over 8,000 men now. Training yard is a perfect place to improve your martial ability. My upbringing has prepared me well for this. Okay. I don't see why we can't just keep rolling. So let's go ahead and declare war. I want to use... I want to keep doing this while we... have the Cassus Belli. So we're going to do a conquest. Oh, he owns multiple counties as well, but this is the one we want, so we're going to do that. I'm going to raise my men. And start marching them. reinforcements can arrive. Not that they're going to make much of a difference, but if I can lose less troops, that would be better. Oh. Legatus Sabus uh, is charging me. Prepared to die. Yep. Oh, and he ran away. He charged me and then ran. Theodulos of Nicomedia has laid claim on my titles. Yeah, he better not try anything. Okay, yep. Victory! 
The next thing I'm just gonna keep chasing his army down. He still has 500 men. Okay. Let's take this contingent out. We're gonna get 500 more men. Military matters, that's good. That's good. Hills. No problem. I'm just gonna gather up all the war score I can by knocking down these little groups of soldiers. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and let's siege down the region we want to take. Another contingent of soldiers. Is he hiring mercenaries? I'm just gonna wipe him out because it's basically free war score. Oh, and we captured him in battle. That was the other thing we could potentially do. Alright. All for peace. Yes, there we go. It's now mine. And ban the troops. I want to do the same thing. I want to go to find the characters. Men, my religion, my culture, not a ruler. He's old. Greek, lowborn. Yeah, let's go ahead and grant him that title. There we go. Alright. That's looking good. Now, the other thing that I need to decide is... If I am ready to abdicate, abdicate the throne here, I'm 57 years old, and I'm fairly stable. My son, dear, it'd be kind of good to just go ahead and let the succession happen. Whoa, whoa, whoa! French and Celtic. That's not good. My grandson, the heir, his heir, is French and Celtic. No, oh, is that his heir? Hold on. Hold the phone. Okay, so his heir, age 13, yeah, French and Celtic. How did that even happen? Alright, well... We'll have to, we'll have to see. Um... What's this? Hot cautery touched the open wound. I couldn't hold the scream back. I cursed the doctor who only laughed, told me to take it easy and not pick on the wound. Oh, I have to treat wounded. Okay, so actually... Yeah, this might be a good time. Just go ahead and abdicate the throne. So, let's just go ahead and do it. I've ruled long enough, my health is no longer what it once was. Perhaps the time has come to pass my titles to my heir. Yes, it is time. Okay. Alright, now we need to... We need to educate this child.
Okay, now... Can I deal with... He's being mentored. I need to re-educate this child. I, I need to re-educate my son. Um... Bring it back to me. See if I can... He's only got a couple of years... Well, three years... Until he becomes a legal age, and see if we can get the culture and religion to change. Okay. Now we're over to men's size, which is what I was afraid of. And we haven't even built this yet, so... What I might do... Is actually hand this out. This county. I don't necessarily need nor want that. So let's find someone to give this to. My religion, my culture, men. Alright, we'll go ahead and we'll grant the landed... Wait a minute, does he have a... He's a ruler? Lord. No, he should be ruler. No ruler. No ruler. Men. My religion. My culture. Right. My father. Okay, I can actually give my former ruler, who I used to be, and grant him a title. Uh, what is it? Uh, Philippopolis. No, not Philippopolis. Adrianopolis. That's what I want to do. Grant landed title, Adrianopolis. There we go. Now, when this castle finishes construction, we'll probably have to give that out to a vassal, but that's... Okay, I have a new heir. Right. Yep, volunteered to uh, voluntary abdi abdicate his rule. Okay. Inherited. Oh, what happened there? Oh, I think the event didn't actually finish. So I need to give that back to me. There we go. New important decisions available. Uh, let's see, yeah, now I need to reshuffle my counts a little bit. Yeah, he's my new spy master. Uh, let's actually... What, what, what? No, 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 no. Hold on. Okay. Okay, that was just weird. I don't know what that, what that was. Was I... Did I get an event accepting my own guardianship? Alright, what do we want to do? We want to... We have a ton of kids already. Let's say, let's do the have ten kids. Um, do we want... Actually, no, let's switch this over to something that gives me stewardship. Business? Yeah, let's do business. There we go. Now, this is a Cult of Titan Uprising. Can I actually raise the levy? Yes, raise the levy underneath that guy and wipe him out. Okay, so... Yes, he's definitely better. Let's 
expand that. And before this happens a lot, let's just take a look. Point. Yeah, let's actually appoint my father as my marshal because of his massive marshal skill. Let's appoint this guy. Award him an honorary... No, we're not designating him regent. Mysticos... Intrigue. This guy's the better Mysticos. And Augur... This guy is the much better Augur. Okay, so... We want to improve diplomatic relations with Pest. I'm going to keep them nice and... Is that where the... Yeah, that is where the capital is. Okay. Um, we want to suppress revolts in here, I believe. Where is that? We want him to proselytize there. Oops. Want him to proselytize there. We want to scheme in our capital, and we want to research economy tech in our capital. Okay, there we go. And let me just look at my vassal opinions. They are pretty decent all around. A few negatives, but no big deal. Alright, and now my... Just, just, just double check... My heir is being tutored by me. Yes. Okay. Is aiming for the stars the ambitious little brat? Nope. Ambitious actually should be fine to take. No. Yep. Let's just take ambitious. Okay. Actually, at this point, this is probably a good place to go ahead and stop now that we've kind of gone through the initial stages of the first succession. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you next time.